As a project manager, you must be aware of how your projects are going. This is where a progress monitoring chart comes in handy. A progress monitoring chart, as the name says, visually represents the progress of a single or multiple projects. Hello everyone, welcome to Excel Demi, your day-to-day -day Excel and VBA tutorial helpline. This is Hadi Ulbasher and today I'll demonstrate how to make a progress monitoring chart in Excel. For this video, I will use Microsoft Excel 365. Let's talk about our dataset first. Here is the name of the projects, their duration, working days, completed work, and the remaining work data. To calculate the completed work, you need to divide working day by duration. For example, in case of MRT1 project, completed work in cell E5 is equals to D5 divided by C5. And to calculate the remaining work, Simply subtract the completed work from 1. If I move to the cell F5, you can see in the formula bar that F5 is equals to 1 minus E5. Let's create the chart now. Select cells B4 to B12, press and hold the control key and select cells E4 to F12. Move to the insert tab from the chart section. Click on insert column or bar chart. This will open different 2D and 3D column and bar chart options. In my case, from the 2D bar, I will choose the stacked bar. This is a basic view of the progress monitoring chart. Place the chart here to get a clear view of the dataset. Let's customize the chart now. You can do this in two ways. From the chart design contextual tab, you will find all the options to customize this chart. Alternatively, you can click on this plus icon, which is chart elements, and customize this chart accordingly. Check the access titles and data labels. This will add access title and data labels to this chart. I don't need this grid line, so I am unchecking the grid lines. Set the horizontal access title as working and remaining days. And the vertical access title as projects. Go to the chart title now and set it as progress monitoring chart. Now I want to try out a different style for this chart. Move to the chart design contextual tab. From the chart styles group, you will get different styles. In my case, I will select style 2. Great, the charts look really nice. And this completes our progress monitoring chart. I have demonstrated the step-by-step -step guide for making a progress monitoring chart in Excel. You can download the practice workbook from the video description to sharpen your Excel skills. Feel free to leave any questions, suggestions, or feedback in the comment section below. To check out our Excel blogs, you can visit excelnemy.com. For more content like this, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching our video. Bye.